We've been hearing about this film since last year already. It's called Sync. It's won multiple awards and was even selected for this year's upcoming Atlanta Film Festival. Now, it's based on Brett Michael Ennis's book, Rachel Weeping. Sync tells the story of Rachel, a Mozambican domestic worker living in Johannesburg whose daughter dies under the care of her South African employer. We're fortunate enough to have with us Shoki Mohapa, who plays Rachel, as well as Amalia Ace, whose character has a fling with Rachel's employer's husband. <laughs> <laughs> and here they are today, ladies. So good to have you on the show this morning. Thanks for having us. Oh, wow, you. listen, yeah. what an incredible film. We will see a bit about it a bit later on. But why was it so important for you two to be involved in telling the story? Um, well, I think it's just uh, an important story because all of us can kind of relate to um, being raised by someone else's mother. Yeah. <laughs> so I think a lot of audiences will be able to respond to that because, and it's like sort of how well do you know the people that are looking after your children or cleaning up after you. So yeah, I think that everyone is able to relate, mm. can relate to South Africa, Absolutely. I think. Yeah, yeah. Yeah, I think the, the themes that we're dealing with, yeah. you know, um, loss, dealing with grief mm -hmm. and um, and forgiveness is something that, that each South African can can relate to, yeah. um, and and yeah, these these characters are are playing in against the stereotypes. Yeah. You know, yes. I think when people yeah. start watching it for the first time, they yeah. might think stereotypical characters, but we're breaking down the stereotypes definitely. Yeah. Absolutely. Yeah. Yeah. Well, yeah. before we talk about the movie anymore, let us first get a sneak peek on what the movie Sunk is all about. Wow, that was pretty <laughs> hectic stuff. What an intense film. Shoki, did you have to undergo any research for this role to make it so much more authentic? Yes, I found um, a, a wonderful woman from Mozambique by the name of Slavia. And so she was able to sort of like bring me into her world. So just knowing her perspective of coming in from Mozambique as an economic, not migrant, but you know what I mean, to look for a better place for um, her family. So I was kind of like exposed to that um, in that in that world and it kind of gave me a bit more empathy because it is a long journey. And so where they end up, unfortunately, is, um, you know, with whatever's happening in our country, um, it's quite difficult to be able to like, um, sort of mix with our people yeah. and then the, the, the problems that they sort of face on a daily basis. Yeah. You guys were yeah. talking about the fact that these are stories that we need to be talking about a lot more, stories that we don't necessarily hear about mm, yeah. in South African lives. Do you think it's important that we start making movies that reflect on these stories even more? I think our audiences are so ready for that. Yeah. You know, I think yeah. it's, it's quite ironic because I think they've always been ready for it. Yeah. But you know, we've recently found a voice and, and the means mm. to produce these type yeah. of films. Yeah. Um, and ugh, it's lovely. Yeah. It's, it's a privilege to be part yeah. of a production like this. Yeah. Yeah. yeah, absolutely. Well, it's a beautiful film and I think it's going to continue to do so well. I mean, it's won tons of awards already and it will continue to do the same thing. Shoki and Amalia, thank you so much for thank being with for us today us. again. Thanks and of course, <laughs> the story is certainly an important one to see and to hear as well. Sync releases this